Hi, my name is Julia, and I'm going to show you how to find the perpendicular line opposite the vertex in a triangle. So we're going to start by drawing a triangle. And let's take let's try the the vertex at the top here. The vertex is any of the corners on a triangle, any of the angles. That's the vertex. There's one. There's one. So. If we have a line that's perpendicular to the side opposite the vertex, got a little wavy, but you guys get it. There's our line. There's our line that's perpendicular. It connects this vertex to the opposite side. This line is important to us because this gives us the height of a triangle. So if you're trying to find the area of a triangle and you choose this as your base, then you need to multiply it by the height and divide by two. You get the height by finding the vertex opposite your base and just drawing a line, a perpendicular line, perpendicular to your base. So let's just try a few more. So if this is my base and that's the vertex I then care about, this would be the perpendicular line. This would be my height. Um, or sometimes the height doesn't show up within a triangle. Like if this is my base, then the line perpendicular extends out to here. And there's your height. And also, as you know, as you may know, when you're finding the area of a triangle, you can pick any side as your base. So if this is my base, that's my height. But if this is my base, then my height, again, I go to the vertex opposite my base. So that's this vertex. And I draw a line perpendicular to that base. This little square box shows that it's perpendicular. That's the notation. So there you have it. My name's Julia. Thank you.